morning it's currently friday the 14th of july 10 30 at the moment so it's really nice and bright in my room i'm really really happy in my bedroom as of yesterday because the days before that were literally just a nightmare like everything was going wrong but at the moment everything seems to be going all right like the next big challenge is for me to kind of put up my furniture um because that's going to be annoying because i hate putting furniture up um but i absolutely love my room i think it looks so 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 pretty so this is where i've been sleeping i've been having quite a lazy day today because um i've just been doing some editing because i don't have much going on today i'm literally just waiting for my bed to arrive from um the range and i've also ordered a basket and some bed sheet there isn't really a rush at the moment because i've got my walls and everything done um and then once my bed arrives that would be like the last piece of furniture because all of my ikea furniture arrived a couple of days ago so the next step is just pretty much me building a furniture so i just have my hamsters over there i just got the box for my mickey desk because i put this together yesterday so here's the desk and i've just got my laundry basket underneath it like i had with my old desk because it also works as a chair um i really really love this desk i can't wait to start like putting stuff in it at the moment it's just got some random bits and bobs in there um but i love it and i'm so in love with my wallpaper it's just so pretty and so subtle and i'm really loving the new light pink wall so i have a few bits which i got for my birthday i don't normally get birthday gifts so this year i'm like super 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 grateful because i haven't really had a birthday gift in a good couple of years i might be doing a birthday haul but i'm not too sure because i didn't really get like that many things but next week i'm going to be seeing charlie again and um, we're going to be going into the town center because he's going to be getting me um a few bits for my birthday because we didn't have a chance to do that when he was around like a couple of days ago because we were super super busy like sorting out my room and stuff here's just a sneak peek of some of my birthday gifts that i got so i got this dior makeup bag from charlie and inside is like a little perfume he also gave me two birthday cards one of them had 20 pounds in it um and then i went to boots and i was gonna um use the 20 pound that charlie gave me for my birthday to treat myself to some soap and glory and i was with my sister at the time and my sister said she would buy me some soap and glory bits for my birthday so you know that was perfect um so here's just a sneak peek of all of the bits that i got apart from this deodorant i don't know why that's in there it's pretty much just my regular favorites because i love soap and glory i use their products all the time um and i was running low so i just you know stocked up boots normally do a three for two offer on soap and glory which is just perfect um so i got six items and basically two of them were free um the only item that i picked up that i haven't tried is this i think it might be new the righteous butter creamy body wash so i'm guessing this is just like a body wash that's super super moisturizing um and i'm just so excited to use this because my favorite scent is the original pink scent um so all of the products that i basically picked up was from the original pink collection apart from the sugar scrub so this is what my mum room is looking like right now um i haven't shown you guys the rest of the house for a good couple of days because it's just been hectic um so my mum has some new carpet which is the same as my carpet we've just got like this bit down which is part of like the hallway carpet like the leftovers but because my mum was moving like her furniture back in she didn't want to like drag it on the floor so we put that there and we still got like a few bits and bobs all over the place and then this is the hallway so we got some new hallway carpet as well um we've just got some extras from my mum's carpet and my carpet in the hallway as like a little rug for the moment um for when they're bringing like all the furniture in that we're getting that we've ordered um so obviously there's my room um and then over here we have the living room the carpet looks so disgustingly dirty um compared to the new carpet so we're going to be getting some wooden flooring in here probably in a couple of months so right now um, this is basically my living room slash dining room um, it's got all of the stuff for my room all of the stuff for my mum's room um, we've just pushed everything down to this side of the room because I've got all of my Ikea furniture here so these are all the bits that need to be made up I've got two of the mum dresses all of my furniture is white by the way um, I have the Alex 9 drawers and then these are just 
some drawers to go into my wardrobe which is over here then i have like a few little bits and bobs that i ordered from ikea in there as well and some screws and stuff hello again it's the 15th of july and it's currently almost 10 o'clock um so i didn't end my vlog yesterday because i honestly didn't really do much so i ordered this really really pretty basket um i already have the small one and the next size up um, but I wanted to see what the large one would look like because I want to put these under my bed. I just think they look really, really nice and they're quite good quality as well. So I just thought I would order one just to see, you know, how big it is. And then I also ordered this bed sheet. I thought it was going to be like the quilt cover and the pillowcases. Um, but I think it's actually the sheet that goes around the mattress. I'm not too sure, but I don't like the colour. I think it looks like a lilac y colour. So today my sister's going to be coming around and helping me put some of the furniture together. I'm just having some of my favourite lemon tea. I'm just waiting for that to cool down. So I've just taken out all the pieces for the mom drawer. This is going to be going there. Um, but right now I want to try and paint the bit where the curtain rail is. So I'm just going to be using this paint which is the same one I used to paint my windowsill. I'm with you. I'm with you. It's about nine o'clock now and my room is looking amazing we managed to get so many things done today um, my sister helped me put on my bed my drawers my wardrobe so we've been doing that for a good couple of hours so over here i have one of the drawers so i'm going to build the other one tomorrow they're still empty i'm going to be putting some of my stuff in there today i just have the hamsters here for now but once the room is done the hamsters will be over here and then i've got my bedside table to go over there but this drawer still has to be moved back a bit so there should be a bit more space there um, and then we've got my wardrobe which is my favorite thing so in my other wardrobe i had all of my jumpers and my jackets hung up um, but now that i've got this wardrobe i have so much more space to um put some more jumpers and stuff because in my other wardrobe it was like completely full up i've got my shelf at the top and then i have this drawer of a glass front but i can't open it all the way at the moment because this is as far as it can go because the door's pushing on the handle so if you're wondering what wardrobe this is this is the pax wardrobe um where you can customize it so you can choose your doors you can choose the frame so i've chosen a white frame and this is 100 centimeters long there's different sizes and then you can choose like what you want inside it so in total this wardrobe was i think just under 300 pounds so this was my most expensive item in my room so once i've got like all of my clothes and stuff set out um let me know if you want me to do like a video of all of my clothes in my drawers to see how i organize it and then my alex 9 drawers are going to be here so let me know if you would like to see a alex 9 drawer tour um and same with my wardrobe as well i could do a wardrobe tour as well once it's all finished so i thought i would show you guys what i've been up to for like the past hour i think it's been i have these um organizers which i got from ikea where is the name um so this is what they're called so in this drawer i've just got um some tops and on this side i just have a bunch of cardigans and inside this drawer that you can't really see too well i've just got my jeans and my jeggings along this side here i've got sort of like black trousers like you know that sort of stretchy material and then here i've just got patterned leggings and then these are just some plain leggings but in here are just things that i'm kind of going to reach for on a everyday Basis. and i've got my little cactuses which are going to be going on my window ledge so i've just put these fairy lights on my bed they only go up to there i just thought it was really really pretty you have a, another pack of these i got them last year from the pound shop around christmas time um but they don't have any batteries in them so i haven't put them up yet so i'm about to um use my new pillows i got these the other day when i went to being q like the first time put my pillows in i'm so 
glad to um, finally get myself some new pillows because I've needed some new ones for so many years. I'm not too sure what I'm going to be using these ones for because they are quite big. I wonder if they can actually fit in this drawer. Yeah, so these can actually fit in this drawer as well, which is really, really good. So I thought I would just update you guys on my progress. Just watching um, Just Jode's Primark call. This has been in my watch later for ages, so I'm just watching that. In this drawer, oh my god, it's quite empty still. So I've just got my tops and I've put all my cardigans in this organiser. And I've got two sort of thicker cardigans back there. Um, and then in here I have all of my crop tops and then I just have some, you know, casual black top. This is kind of the only drawer apart from like my pyjama drawer where I actually have coloured clothes. So I finished sorting out my room now. I think it's sometime after one o'clock. So I'm off to bed now and I'll speak to you guys in the morning. So this is what my bed looks like during the day. I've literally just got out of it so I haven't spread it yet. Onto my wardrobe. So I managed to put most of my bags up here. Here I just have all of my jumpers and my leather jacket. And here is my bedside table, which is like one of my favorite items in my room. If you saw, I think vlog number two, then you would have seen when I unboxed this. Um, so I went and got it out of the living room today and I love it. I think it's so pretty. So I've just got this fake plant, which is from Ikea. And then I have my favorite drinking glass so far inside my bedside table. I just have my iPad, my phone, my glasses and my soap and glory righteous butter so one thing i noticed this morning which i don't know why but it just makes me so happy um this isn't the original handle for this um for this bedside table it was just a plain silver one and i ordered this really cheap like knob off amazon and then i noticed that it's exactly the same as the ones on my bed but this is just a bigger one so how weird is that my new pillows they're really nice they feel really good quality but they are quite soft and i prefer firm pillows so when i looked at the back of the packaging today um it said the softness was free so it's honestly not that firm at all and i was talking to charlie this morning and i was saying to him that my pillows felt really really flat so he suggested that i put the two pillows into one pillowcase and it's kind of made it a bit firmer before i forget this is what it kind of looks like underneath my bed so good morning you guys sorry i didn't end my vlog yesterday i literally didn't do anything um for the whole day really apart from organize my stuff under my bed in the morning um so it's currently afternoon actually i think it's just gone um one o'clock so i'm just putting the last drawer together so i've made the frame and now i'm just making the drawers this is the second one and i have two more to make and the weather outside is so 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 sunny so i've just got some ice cold water in um this travel mug and then today i'm going to go ahead and try to make my alex nine drawers so both of my hamsters are currently awake we've got cashmere over here who's super active um i just gave them a piece of apple um cashmere's eating a bit of hers and then she's just left it um and then we've got a cupcake who was awake not sure where she's gone now but i gave her a piece of apple as well and she's just left it on the wheel um but the hamsters are doing really really well um so i'll be back making hamster videos again in a couple of weeks most likely so leave some suggestions in the comments on what um hamster videos you guys would like to see I'm just about to start on the Alex Nine drawers. This box is so heavy. Um, I've just been looking at the instructions and it doesn't look too hard to make. Um, you've just got to put the frame up, which seems pretty um, simple. And then the drawers itself, they are pretty um, easy to make. It's just that there's quite a few of them, so it's going to take quite a while. So I've got all the pieces out of the box. So here they are. Um, hopefully it's not going to be too difficult to put together. So I'm just about to eat my lunch now. I'm having a 
sausage roll and some chips and I'm absolutely starving. This is all I've managed to do of the um, Alex 9 drawers so far. So now I have the task of building all of the drawers which is pretty simple to do but it's going to take quite a while. Um, but yeah I'm quite excited to start putting my stuff in there. I've decided to put it against the wardrobe um, and then I have a little gap there. Not sure if I should put it in the middle but I think it looks better against the wardrobe so i'm really happy that it's all put together now this took i don't know how long this took probably about two hours um because it took forever to make all of the drawers but it's a pretty simple um concept so at the top you have um five small drawers and then at the bottom you have four slightly deeper drawers i've just brought in all of my hair stuff my makeup and in these bags i've just got like my skincare most of them are going to be going into the alex nine drawers not sure if i want to display my makeup on my desk like i had before it's kind of sad that i'm not going to be doing any more redecorate my bedroom vlogs because i really enjoyed filming these every single day the good thing is i get to enjoy my new room i am just in love with it i'm so happy with how it turned out everything is just so beautiful and i can't wait to get it like completely finished um but i'm feeling really proud of myself because i painted the walls myself i pretty much put the wallpaper up myself with a bit of help um from my mom and charlie um i'm not too sure when i'm going to be doing another vlog or when i'm gonna get back on track with my hamster videos because i still have like so much to kind of um sort out but definitely let me know in the comments if you like to see a sort of wardrobe tour or tour of like all of my clothes and stuff and how i like properly store them once i've got my room like properly together or just leave some video suggestions in the comments to do with like bedroom related stuff um because i want to do some more like videos like that um but yeah so i'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog here i hope you guys enjoyed watching it if you did give it a big thumbs up and leave a comment down below don't forget to check out my social medias and my website which will be left down below in the description so bye for now guys